Denmark. No, 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 no. No, 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 everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel i know it's been a long time since i said that but i'm really excited to be bringing this new series called cramping my style with the gents where my male friends will be joining the ministerial couch and they will be experiencing period pain yes you heard right period pain we know so many men in our lives who will say period pain is dramatic or we should get over it but now we're actually going to put them to the test to see if they can handle period cramps so let's get into the first episode where I'm joined by my lovely friend who is a stand-up comedian, football lover, Man United fan, Dylan Oliphant. I am going to ask you a set of questions. Please feel free to answer them. You feel it. I haven't even started it. <laughs> you are in trouble. I haven't, you are in trouble. I haven't even started anything. Like a I haven't even started anything. No, 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 no. What were you feeling? <laughs> Don't lie. I promise you. Don't lie. Don't lie. Don't lie. Don't lie. Don't lie. Don't lie. Okay. No, 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 no. Yeah, it's maybe heating up. Just to, you know. Okay, cool. Alright, so with each and every question that I ask you, you can feel free to answer it no matter, you know, feel comfortable, answer it however you want to. And when you're done answering, I'm going to increase the intensity. Okay. If it gets too difficult, you may use the safe word, vagina. Vagina. Right. Okay, first question. Dylan, we live in a country where a lot of things can happen, whether it be bad or good. And often, as comedians, your job is to make people laugh, but also have people aware of the world they live in. Why did you choose to be a stand-up comedian and not a politician? Because stand-up comedians don't... We can point out the problem, but you don't have to fix the problem. Okay, right. <laughs> and that's way easier. Pointing out the problem is way easier than fixing the problem. But don't you think politicians are... Pointing out the problems <laughs> yeah. and not fixing it, yeah. I mean. Yeah, but no one's gonna be like, hold us accountable or fire us, we're not public protectors. True. Yeah. Hashtag so. too soon. <laughs> Hashtag too soon. Okay. I'm increasing the level. We are on level two. All right. A study conducted in 2017 states that, the, that men are more attractive when wearing red or blue on a date. What do you think is the worst thing that a person can put on their bio on a dating app? The worst thing they can put on their bio? Sure. Yeah. What's the worst thing? What's the worst thing? Oh, is it they are alpha males? Yes, that's... But don't you think that's why they put on their pictures like when a man is wearing a tank top? It's And my alpha male. Alpha, so like on your bio, it's alpha male. Alpha male is like, uh, alpha male is like those uh, Kevin Samuels do. <laughs> You've seen Kevin Samuels. That's mad cringe, no? You're <laughs> <laughs> like, no, no. Not in peace. <laughs> wow, wow. Okay, so just, uh, so just, so just alpha male. Um, alpha male. Um, very shocking. <laughs> what the the pain? The pain. Yeah. Oh, so you feeling something? I, I can feel something. On level two. Yeah. Okay. And now we're getting there. What level five? <laughs> 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 okay, so it's just that? the ten. Oh. <laughs> so it's just so you just so you just so think you alpha worse. male is the worst thing to put on a bi dating bio and not like, you know, I don't know. Give me an example. Anti vaxxer or yeah, alpha male. Yeah, alpha male usually comes with. Big. I always. Take all those things all together. Alpha male usually comes with anti vaxxer Okay. Because they are better than science. Okay. So, alpha male is anti vaxxer And, um, Jesus loving. Oh. Oof. Jesus lover. Yeah. Uh, and your data, but I think that's fine though. I don't know. <laughs> okay, you heard it first from Dylan. Jesus lover. Jesus if lover. Jesus lover is. Have you ever made a nice Jesus lover? Like, 
Someone without cheese. No, wait, 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 I gotta say it like this. Someone. It's usually the people who proclaim to love. Okay. Who put it out there that they love. Jesus. They're, 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 they don't. They don't. They're really just saying it for the sake they're of it. Like, they're saying it for the clout. I want you to swipe right. Okay, so alpha male and swipe Jesus right. lover, ladies, if you see that on Made of Bright, just run, <laughs> according to Dylan Oliphant. Right, right. All right, we go to level three. Not eating anything on level three? It's mild. Okay, we love to see. Okay, cool. Level three. According to <laughs> 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 Okay. Yeah. I love how you're maintaining calm and posture. Like you know, like there's this pillows. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So, according to our government, we are living in a fourth industrial revolution where technology is making an, imp an impact on how we live our lives. What is the best Wi-Fi name you have seen in your entire life? <laughs> <laughs> we are only on level three. I know. <laughs> Let's go. Um, what is the best Wi Fi name you've ever seen in your entire life? <laughs> you can't laugh, thank you for that. You can't laugh at my pain. What men who laugh at our pain? I would never saying? laugh at any woman's pain. <laughs> <laughs> I would never laugh at any woman's pain. Um, What's the best way, honey? <laughs> <laughs> You've seen in your entire life. I'm trying to think. I don't know. Where I go, where I, where I have Wi Fi, people always say, like, mm -hmm. Huawei. Z double double <laughs> four six eight. You know, like they've yeah. got those Wi Fi. I haven't, yeah. I haven't actually haven't seen, like, my friend is just his name. I actually haven't seen one. So, not yeah. like Pretty Fly for Wi Fi? Pretty Fly for Wi Fi. That's a dope one. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, the places that you're going them. through is just Huawei. The places I just go, like, the Huawei. Those people are lazy. They are. Because you can change your Wi Fi. You can. Oh, I my Wi Fi. It might just be that time of the month for it. Well, <laughs> I was gonna say this, uh, we're not making it to level three. <laughs> we definitely not gonna Okay, I think you're gonna enjoy this question, but I unfortunately have to put the, the intensity up. So we now move on to level four. Okay. <laughs> According to our government, no, 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 sorry. The football industry makes more money than any other sports in the world. You should know this. According to a sports blog, 86% of men watch football on a regular basis. The patriarchy, a social system designed to benefit men, believes that a real man should not convey any emotions. Why is it that men cry when their football team loses a match? Why do men cry when their football team loses a match? They call. <laughs> Because they've never had periods. <laughs> no, you can't. No, no, no. But mostly. Yes. Sure. You just want me. You can add up. Like, do you want us to like? Do you want to like hot water bottle? <laughs> Um, so why is it that men cry? <laughs> <laughs> Somebody please take the video. <laughs> men cry for football because it's the only thing that men has. Well, it's not the only thing. Men cry for football because other men are going to make fun of them. And no man wants to be made fun of by another man. But why is it that like over a, a small ball, like a ball, and then like, because it doesn't get into a goalpost, and then you guys like... Lose your mind. Why? Because you spend money on our t shirts. Okay. You spend money on snacks. Okay. You spend money on that DSTV. So then why don't you cry when someone breaks up? Love DSTV. 
<laughs> why don't you why don't you cry when someone breaks up with you? It's the same. It's the same time investment, emotional investment. Oh, because breakup means forever. You can't break up with your body. Okay, I'm satisfied with that answer. I guess. We now move on to yeah. level five. And now I must make note that from level five onwards you will experience real period pain. So level five uh -huh. is <laughs> Yes. So level five. And then from onwards level eight it's then becomes labor pain. So Okay. Yeah. No, we're not gonna make it to labor pain. Level five. Woof. 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 Dylan. Yes. Why did the chicken cross the road? <laughs> to get beautiful. To get beautiful. To get beautiful. Okay. Yes. Okay. I'm satisfied with that answer. Ooh. We're gonna move to level. I can go on. <laughs> There's no need to. Um, I'm gonna move on. Okay. To level six. Would you rather fight a hundred duck-sized horses or one horse-sized duck? <laughs> one horse-sized duck. Why? Because ducks are like so... S but it's a horse-sized duck. So it has the beak. Think about it. Think about it. Okay, I see. I see. <laughs> that is so it's that time for me. Because it's a hundred duck-sized horses Ooh. So small ducks that are horses, and then it's oh no vagina. Oh. <laughs> oh, vagina. Okay. vagina. Okay, we're off. I'm sorry. <laughs> so Dylan only made it to question six. Um, Ooh. I'm strong. If you think there is a male celebrity that you reckon can make it to level 10, please be sure to comment down below. Not so music. <laughs> Even if it's not music, we'd we'll be more than happy to have him here. Um, Dylan, how do you feel about period pain? Um, you know, it is a really growing, really. I've really grown ever since I've had my first period. Was it? Was it? Did I at least? Did I at least make it painful? Yeah. Eh? Yeah. It was at least. It's your like, experience, right? Yeah, but you We're said. We're validating. Like, so how was it? Uh, like. No, I mean, like, did I make it for period pain? Yeah. Like, what was your feeling? What was your experience of it? Like, now would you take period pain seriously when someone says I have period pain? Like. Yeah. No. I. Um. I will always take period pain seriously from today on. Okay. This is my this is my moment. I agree. I've changed. I will not see periods as I've seen them before. It's just ah, it's just a little tummy. It's, it's just a little tummy ache you've been dramatic. Being dramatic, yeah. We no. saw we saw you being dramatic. Yeah, I no, appreciate it, it. It period pain is the worst pain. Okay. It's the worst pain I've I've had in a while. Okay. Yeah. We appreciate you. For being on the minister's And I'm a Man United supporter, so, so I know pain. <laughs> you should wash the dishes. Well, he didn't make it to level 10, so unfortunately, fortunately, I guess, it means you're not doing any other task other than remaining on the couch. So thank you to being um, a menstrual ally and... Thank you for helping me. You're welcome. I appreciate that. Like I said, anyone you'd like to see um, on the ministerial couch experiencing period pain, please comment below. But you know what to do. Subscribe, hit that bell button so you know when the next family meeting will be on. Bye!